Hello, my young friends, and Merry Christmas. I hope all of you had a wonderful day yesterday that you were able to celebrate with your family and friends, and I'm sure that you received lots of gifts and probably ate really good food, too. I'm still wearing my Jingle Bell necklace because I'm still in the Christmas spirit. Okay, I wanna to talk to you about two gifts that I received yesterday. First of all, oh, I sat down and I looked at this box and I thought, this is beautiful. It is so colorful and it has a snowman on it and wow, a beautiful bow. It must really have something wonderful inside. So I opened it up very carefully and I looked inside was empty there was nothing in it and I thought well makes me kind of sad I thought it was gonna be a really great gift because it was so beautiful oh well then I was handed this gift and it was plain it didn't have any wrapping on it didn't have any bows it didn't even have a tag but I was told it was for me so I thought, well, it must not be very great because it's not wrapped, it's not very pretty, and it's plain. Well, I opened it up, not expecting much. And I looked, and it was a cast iron skillet, something I have wanted. So I was so happy to get that. And it made me think, wow, look at what I got in this plain box. And that's kind of the way it was with the baby Jesus. Jesus came into the world as a tiny baby. He was born in a barn. He was put in a manger where the animals ate their food. He was plain. He was not in a fancy crown or a golden robe. He was the son of God, but he was humble. And you know what? That's what makes him so special, and that's what makes Jesus the greatest gift God has ever given us. So remember, don't be fooled by beautiful boxes and fancy wrapping. Sometimes it's the plain gifts that are the best, and Jesus is the best gift ever. Okay, let's bow our heads and say a prayer. Dear God, thank you for your son who came to us as a baby, plain and simple. But thank you for letting him be the greatest gift we could ever receive. We love you and we thank you. Amen. Okay, boys and girls. Once again, Merry Christmas. I hope you have a wonderful break from school and a Happy New Year.